Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to Market Misfit. So we're going to look at the XRP chart mainly. So we just dropped this signal inside of the group Market Misfits. If you're not part of Market Misfits, come on over to Market Misfits. We're dropping an analysis and more news and signals, XRP signals, Solana signals. We're about to go over a also... We're about to go over Casper cause right now. It looks like it might be setting up. We're seeing XRP continue down a little bit. We had recently had a pullback. We're going to see if this is a pullback or not. We're going to take a look at Bitcoin also. So let's get into this article. I wasn't going to go over an article, but I started reading this. And this goes with right with what we were talking about earlier on our previous video to where you know, right now is not the time to be ditching your bags despite all this. And so this is going, this coincides with, you know, our view that we are holding right now. And so just wanted to go over this article real quick and we will take a look at the price action. A prominent XRP analyst believes the surge is on the horizon with the, with history set to potentially repeat itself. And so this guy gives the exact same scenario, one of the exact same scenarios that we've been looking at. And so, so I will share it with everybody. This is pretty cool. The XR, the price of XRP has underperformed the market since September. At the same time, a recent security breach involving Ripple co-founder Chris Larson led to further losses this week, extinguishing hopes of an imminent XRP recovery. However, a prominent analyst, JD, has differing opinions, arguing that a reversal of fortunes for XRP holder, holders is right around the corner. Notably, the analysts accurately called the bottom of the market January 22nd at a time when many were still bullish on XRP's prospects. In a recent post, XJD noted the XRP price is in, a system, is, is in a symmetrical triangle and could break out once the moving average convergence divergence MACD indicator crosses zero. Nonetheless, many XRP holders have gotten tired of waiting for price rebound and sold off their assets right before the surge. So with the company, the chart, the analyst points out that a similar symmetrical triangle between 2014, 2017 led to a 600 times rally in the price towards the end of the year. So nonetheless, X, XRP holders had gotten tired of waiting for price rebound and sold off their assets right before the surge. JD urged current XRP holders not to be so-called dumb money and exit their position right before the potential run-up. He concludes by adding with an ire of certainty that 2024 will be the year of much-anticipated XRP breakout. So this right here, this looks familiar. He's pointing out this spring right here. We did this several times. He's calling for a low down here. And that's, you know, we were looking, whatever the length this was, we measured it a little bit different than what he did, but same concept. This is what we go over a lot in our trainings and everything because a lot of times this spring right here is why you get stopped out or why people get stopped out because you get in after or before this. But this is one of the telltale signs, and we're going to go over it more on the chart. This is one of the telltale, 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 telltale <laughs> This is what that's one of the major signs that you can come to a better conclusion that more than likely the cycle is over and things are about to go the other direction. But anyways, let's continue on here. While the analysts continue to call for patience on XR on the part of XRP holders, the crypto asset had continued to slide, falling as low as 49 cents over the past 24 hours. Within the same period, popular stablecoin USDC has overtaken XRP as the sixth largest crypto crypto by art by Within the same period, popular stablecoin USDC has overtaken XRP as the sixth largest crypto by market capitalization. At the time of writing, USDC has a market cap of $26.8 billion, $200 million more than XRP, which stands at $26.6 billion. Recall that in December, Solana also overtook XRP and now boasts a market cap of around $41.2 billion. XRP holders will hope that things turn around for the asset soon. Ev evidently, a negative outcome would mean more losses and as investors grow impatient and rotate their investments into their, their, 
into other assets that appear to have more potential. So that's again, despite all uh, the speculation and everything of this, we're going to take a look at XRP and you know reestate what these were from earlier. This was just from dropped in the group today. So make sure to make it to market misfits. Not suggesting anybody take this with real money, but get into the training and apply the apply the philosophies methods you know if you're needing if you're needing some help there's some help in there we have other courses that are more detailed and set up for people that are more serious if you're either one of those or you just want to come and check us out just come check us out and you know that's why we set it up to be free because you know i think that's the way that it should be but anyway so looking at this we posted this and this one almost just looked too pretty we talked about this possibility coming up here to the to this trend but it happened before that or it seems to be happening before that but i wanted to go over this real quick because if a lot of times when there's a head and shoulders then and you can see this as a head and shoulders if you want to that shoulder head shoulder but uh a lot of the times this is this turns into our setup so gotta stay have to stay um yeah making sure you're ready if another setup to go long comes out so this will be a descending broadening cone and so this typically breaks out bullish so it's pretty much the opposite of the opposite of the rising wedge in both aspects it's going down this one's going up and this one's wide at the beginning this one's wide at the end both are the same so whether or not this is a regular triangle or a, a backwards basically triangle if it's aiming down then it's more bullish if the flat's top if the if the top is flat then it's more bullish if it's pointing up into a resistance then it's more bearish but um, anyways, looking for a recess down here on XRP at around 50 cents. We're still trading on the three minute, you know. So let's take a look at Bitcoin. Another reason why I went to get on is because I saw Bitcoin continue to have better, seem to have better sediment. So let's take a look at Bitcoin to see where we are real fast. Didn't quite get engulfing on the last hour. And I wanted to take a look at cause. Also, what? First, actually, I want to take a look at the altcoin market to see what's happened, if anything has happened. So we're still looking for a break up here. To see if we get a bullish breakout. Right here for the altcoin, altcoin market. So this is excluding the top 10. So this is like the real altcoin, alt, altcoin market. So let's take a look. at cause i don't really know a whole lot about this coin but i couldn't help but notice that it appears to be setting up and i know that it's had a really good run so far you know buying into rallies without fundamental without fundamental reason you know it's not something too fond of but you know if you're a passive technical day trader it shouldn't matter too much Bitcoin, if Bitcoin's looking bullish, we get a breakout on Bitcoin and we see our setup, a setup that we're very familiar with, with several other coins, see it, the potential of it setting up here, then why would we not seize that opportunity? So I'll say if this was that, maybe get another pull back further. <clears throat> Excuse me, maybe get a head and shoulders here. So what we'll be looking for is a cross is a cross over this trend or across here at around 10 cents to one. So 10 to one cents. That's how you say it. So across here on the hour and we'll be getting in there. But um, let's take a look at the XRP Bitcoin chart. This is something else is wanted to check out. So we are continuing down and on a larger time scale. 
just looking at this, like this is the weekly trend down here. So just because we're thinking the XRP is showing, there's a good chance that during all this stuff, the XRP is going to just blast off. Cause I always just kind of felt that way. It only makes sense that it would happen at the end. I don't know if all the conspiracies and things like that are true, but for XRP to take off at the end of the bull market, as all hell's breaking, all hell's breaking loose in Ripple, you know, it's already beginning to happen. So again, not financial advice, but if you hadn't already loaded bags and, you know, dollar cost averaging in is the way to go long term. But um, anyways, you guys, so we're still away from the supporting trend and away from the weekly trend on the XRP BTC chart on the one hour. Looks like we could be we're just been in a range right here so wait and see what happens with the range always keep an eye on this you know because if we're see if we're going to see xrp move independently or if we can predict if we can predict a trend help help us to not, not predict a trend but you know to maybe spot a trend faster a trend reversal or something on xrp then you know that would be very useful too so we're in a bit of a descending channel right here but um anyways you guys that's going to do it for this one we will see you all in the next one See ya.